Everyone that works at the Institute, which we're a very small team, is completely driven by personalization and student-centered learning environments. There's an information age around them. There's knowledge all around. And so how do you harness knowledge for each learner? We are preparing students for a very different world than what the traditional school system has been built to prepare students for. The FUSE Fellowship is an initiative the Highlander Institute has spearheaded, and it really has two purposes. Training a group of educators who have an interest in a passion for blended learning, and simultaneously, as they're getting that training, they're providing in-kind services to districts around the state. Sean and I have worked together since 2007. His work as a visionary around this is just so vital. Blended is important for a lot of reasons. Outside of school, students are super excited about learning new things independently. But then when they come into the classroom, the idea is that someone is telling them what they're going to learn and what pace they're going to learn and how it's going to be measured. And the students get excited about opportunities to be able to access information anywhere. They get excited about the ability to be able to build things that are unique. We had a lot of really excited early adopter teachers across the state of Rhode Island. I'm working with other exceptional teachers meeting other exceptional classroom teachers and really advocating for best classroom practices around blended learning. If we got these grant funds, we would find ways to just reinvest in more of these FUSE fellows. We have something called flex funds, which are opportunities for our fellows to then come up with their own ideas of ways that they want to use their resources to go to conferences to expand their learning, to come up with their own initiatives that they want to drive within their own school buildings, and also to even come up with their own kind of entrepreneurial ventures if that's something that drives them. Sean's leadership is dynamic. Dynamic. It's just highly professional. He's a visionary. Everybody wants to be around Sean. He's got this incredible mind. He just draws you in, and what I love about Sean, and sometimes I hate about Sean, is he pushes you to go mm -hmm. as far as you possibly can. It's reinvigorated my teaching. I mean, he enables us to go farther than I ever thought I would be able to. My experience so far has just been phenomenal.